What's up everybody? Welcome to the Rookie Rookie Show. Obviously you have YouTube playing as we're stopped, but why did I want to show you guys before I get to driving? What is it? Well, if you have a rubber floor and stuff to keep clean, this stuff will definitely help you out big, big time. As you can see, I just used it on my floor and it's shiny, it'll get dirty less and it'll be easier to clean. In these uncertain times, you definitely want to do everything you can to keep your truck clean from the germs. I've been taking my shoes off there and I'm going to continue that. If you're not doing it, I would definitely recommend you to do so. This seed is like tough to keep clean. It gets dirty so quick and it's hard to get off. I wish I got a leather one, but oh well. There's my inverter that I disconnected. I'm going to have to reconnect it under the bed, keep my waters there. This thing stays keeping it cool. And then, yeah, I mean, this is a great product to clean your floors or any rubber surfaces. This, I mean, this for your tire, but yeah, let's get you guys on the camera on the hat. And I know some of you have been asking, what is it that I use for filmmaking? Here it is. There's a nice microphone. I cut this out. It's a GoPro with an adapter. Just slap this on your head and uh, yeah, you're good to go in case you were wondering what I record with. So uh, let's get to uh, recording. All right, let's get this going. We got the good old magnificent view. The microphone is on. It's a beautiful day outside. My windshield is not as clean as it could be, but it is what it is. And uh, let's get going. I'm almost home uh, I have a delivery tonight but I have so many hours that uh, I'll just go ahead and stop and go home and shower and then I'll go to my delivery not really a good place to stop sensor and then uh, the gauge worked fine and now recently it stopped working again and it's got a new speedometer recently put on as well so I have no idea what is going on I'm gonna have to check all of the connections and see uh, what's going on because I mean clearly not a speed sensor or speedometer so we'll have to see what's going on with this because as you can tell it like doesn't really work until like 45 uh, which it's very inconvenient I, I just look at my GPS it's accurate right now 60 on there is 60 but I don't follow that this needs to get fixed uh, but yeah to point that out it's been fixed now I broke again now I'm going home We'll get that fixed before I go back on the road. It's like so hot outside, the fan automatically turns on right away. Yeah, it's it's a crazy world uh, nowadays with everything that's been like going on. I figured I'd make a video, do some talking on it. The sun is like blaring into the camera, I can tell. Let's see if this will maybe help. Oh, you can see me and the camera doesn't really help in the mirror I mean we'll try to see if we can edit the brightness on the post-production but yeah it's been a crazy week like I've been at shippers and receivers and they treat drivers like crap it's kind of like run away out of here you have a disease I understand we're practicing social distancing but that's no reason to 
treat someone like crap. Like, I'm delivering the fright that I touched if you're so worried that I might have something. It's kind of crazy. I was at the shipper and it was like pouring rain and they have a little lobby and uh, they would let only one of us inside at a time, which was kind of ridiculous to me. Uh, and we would be standing outside in rain, like 10 of us, because you can't wait in your truck because uh, you can't wait in your truck because you're going to lose your spot in line. Kind of ridiculous, but hey, it is what it is. Anyways, today is Thursday. The date is 26th, I believe. I'm going home here. I was on the road doing short runs. I don't really uh, want to go on a long run to New Jersey or anything. First and foremost, there's a lot of reported coronavirus cases up there. Second, I don't want to show up 900 miles away from home and the company's like closed because there was a coronavirus case in there. So pretty crazy everywhere, no matter where it is that you go. However, I've been sticking around locally, so we'll see what happens. We're rolling here, just going home. I might as well just take a break at home and then go, because I have so many hours. My delivery is like way later tonight, after like 2, 3 a.m. at Aldi, in case you're wondering. But yeah, it's crazy. You go to places to get food, there's like no food being served or if it is it's carry out only you can't really sit anywhere inside and eat you have to take everything for carry out it's just crazy and the fact that they closed the rest areas in like Pennsylvania like where are we gonna park there's nowhere to park already and you shut down rest areas truck stops where the hell are we gonna go let me take a sip of that crazy times crazy times but yeah I figured I'd give you guys an update here and uh, we're just gonna keep on rolling catch you guys later probably tonight later guys it is hailing so hard Yeah, guys, we're here. We're empty, but uh, I'm not gonna be moving anywhere anytime soon. That's it for today's video. It is hailing. It is hailing really, really hard. Catch you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching.